Hey, hello guys. Today I want to show you guys some PC settings for Modern Warfare that helps me improve my frames a lot, my visibility a lot, and I'm hoping it works for you guys too. All right, so first things first, we're going to go into the graphic settings. I have mine set on full screen. I'm playing on a 144 hertz monitor and render resolution. Make sure this is at 100. If you're still struggling with getting good frames after this, you could lower this to about 75 to 80. The game might just look a little poopy compared to before but uh if you're struggling with frames even after this video that is something that you might want to try um make sure you have v-sync disabled i have the custom frame limit on so basically i just have this maxed all the way out to 300 i don't actually get 300 frames i usually get around like 160 to 200 and in the menu i just have it set to 60 so my gpu isn't overworking while i'm just in the menus here and we're gonna scroll down and for texture resolution i have on normal you could go on low or lowest for this as well uh reason i have it set to normal is because i want the game to look a little better for like the streams and youtube videos so that's why i have it set to normal here for the texture filter i have this set to low particle quality set to low bullet impact and sprays i have this enabled i just kind of like having this turned on i guess this is kind of a personal preference thing i haven't noticed any difference fps wise with this enabled or disabled so i just have this on personal preference here uh tessellation disabled shadow map resolution low um i have the cache spot shadows and cache sun shadows both enabled i believe this helps the maps load quicker uh correct me if i'm wrong but i don't think this affects your frames or anything whatsoever um particle lighting i have set to low ray tracing disabled ambient occlusion disabled screen space reflection disabled now here with anti-aliasing if you're not going to be streaming or making videos or anything i would turn this off um i've noticed it helps visibility a lot like I have a hard time seeing enemies in this game and with it turned off it makes it a little easier for me to see people because it it almost looks like people have sort of like a little glow around them with this off maybe it's just placebo maybe i'm crazy but that's what i've noticed with this off reason i have it set to s m a a t 2 x is because with this off the game doesn't look the best but like i said it improves visibility so much for me in my opinion and it might for you too um but with this set to s m a a t 2 x the game just looks a lot smoother and everything so it looks better on stream and in videos for me so that's why i have it set here i'm still tempted to turn this off and just say fuck it dude because i, I like it so much better with it off i just for now this is what i have it set at but if you're not going to be streaming or doing youtube videos or whatnot i'd turn it off uh depth of field i turn that off if you look over here on the right this is what depth of field looks like when it's turned off you notice the reticles not blurry or anything with it on for some reason like your reticle and everything looks blurry game just looks better in my opinion with it disabled and that should also uh help with frames as well uh filmic strength turn this all the way down you don't want that that's just gonna make the game look blurry same with world motion blur and weapon motion blur you're gonna want to turn those off that just makes everything look more blurry and hard to spot people and just generally looks like ass uh film grain same thing turn it off makes everything kind of look blurry okay so i just want to go over field of view quick so i used to have this set at 120 i really liked how the game felt everything felt more fast paced with it at 120 but uh I had trouble spotting enemies that were far away because it was just so zoomed out, you know? So I set this down to 100 and the game still feels pretty fast paced and I have a lot easier time spotting enemies. So I guess this is personal preference, but that's just what I prefer. And when you go into advanced here and ADS field of view, if this is set to independent, um, when you ADS with a gun, it'll be locked to the default field of view. So everything will look more zoomed in this is what i prefer it makes it easier to shoot enemies in my opinion because they're bigger targets if you switch this over to affected uh when you're when you ads uh your field of view will be unchanged this is all personal preference i prefer independent because i like it to look more zoomed in when i ads like i said it makes it the 
enemies look bigger and easier to shoot in my opinion and then i'll just go over audio really quick i prefer midnight mode and i have the master volume just turned down to 85 just because it's the volume in this game is insanely loud and then i turned down the dialogue volume to 50 percent because they're just always screaming in my ear and with this setting um everything's more like blended together like the air strikes and everything and the kill streaks are still loud but they're not as insanely loud as they were before when i was using the studio reference setting um and i'm having no trouble hearing footsteps as long as i'm not jamming out to music while i'm playing but yeah those are all the settings i use guys um i hope they work for you if they don't work for you i guess comment and let me know why and i'll i'll do my best to help i also do stream over at twitch.tv webzy six days a week so i may be live when you're watching this video so you could go over there and ask any questions if you need help with anything i can do my best to help but uh these settings worked really good for me i hope they work really good for you if they didn't i'm sorry just let me know why and uh i'll do my best to help okay um thank you for watching guys Here's the web. Peace.